what's going on there, YouTube? Uh, we are back, Mosh Vapor. I am Matt. Josh. And uh, today we're going to be bringing you guys another juice review. Uh, today we're going to be looking at HatTrickVapor.com. Uh, this is a fairly new company, just started in the early 2013. Um, we actually received these juices. Uh, Jamie and Jonathan, Jonathan, we would like to thank you very much. Thanks um, a lot. They sent us 515 mils to sample, which is awesome. Um, they asked us if we wanted to pick out some of our, you know, some of their flavors to, to try. Uh, me and Josh, you know, we'll try anything. Um, two of them we did pick out ourselves. Um, one's Boogeyman's Blood, one is Chinchilla Venom. Both of them have bomb ass names, partially the reason why we picked them out. I even know Chinchillas had Venom. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm gonna start this one off. Josh is gonna, you know, give you a little bit more about Hattrick Vapor. Uh, but today we actually have a tobacco vape for you guys. Uh, this one's gonna be called Lasso. Uh, all of these we got. Uh, their blends about 50/50, uh, 12 nicotine for the strength. Um, but I'm gonna start this one off with Lasso, which is a sweet and smooth tobacco. Uh, just a little background for you guys. Uh, Majority of their juices are vape ready. They are pre-steeped. Uh, the only two exceptions of that is a custom mix or a new batch of the liquid might require some steep time. They'll they'll sell, uh, tell you in the email that you sent that they send you just to let you know what the steep time they recommend is. I think they recommended us ten days. Okay, Jamie and Jonathan, I'm sorry if you guys didn't. I know one of these companies said ten days. It might be hat trick. It might not be, but it, it's been about. Two weeks. Yeah, so definitely two good weeks. Times. Yeah. Uh, all their nicotine and flavorings are USA sourced. Everything is kosher, which is good. Uh, they use a 99.9% .9 USP uh, PG and 100% USP VG. Uh, like Matt said, their standard mix is 50 50. Uh, they have 5 mil, 15, 30 mil, and 50 mil. Uh, 5 mil runs you 450. 15 mil is 823. 30 mil is 1341. I know these are weird uh, prices, but hey. And a 50 mil is $20.46. Uh, nicotine, okay. yeah, not bad at all. Uh, nicotine levels are 0, 6, 12, 18, and 24. Uh, and they also do have, right when you go on their website, a little square pops up. You can save 10% just by liking them on Facebook or following them on Twitter, which is pretty cool just to get out right off the bat a discount. Uh, another thing is they also do have an email sign up. Uh, you can send them your email and what it is is a little newsletter and they do crazy discounts. Uh, they just did one for their uh, for spring. It was 40% off juice, which is I mean almost half off juice at already amazingly good prices. I, I can't complain with that. But enough talking for me, I'm gonna vape on this lasso real quick. Uh, we are doing kind of like a little double feature today. We got um, we just did our, our last juice review. Uh, we're going to be doing another one. So yes, we are wearing the same clothes. I'm drinking the exact same beer I was. Um, I did a wardrobe change. <laughs> I shaved my hair. But Here's these me. these might not come out the same day depending on you know how the uploading and editing and all that goes. Um, but more about Hattrick Vapor, uh, the bottles are super, super nice, got a little needle tip on the end of them, super squishy, no, no problems at all with the juice flowing out of them. Um, but about Lasso, um, if I'm ever going to be getting the tobacco vape, Hattrick Vapor, you guys have my sale. Uh, Lasso is one of, probably one of the best tobacco vapes I've had. Um, sweet smooth tobacco like they you know like they put in their description that's exactly what I'm getting uh, super super good yeah definitely a smooth tobacco with some nice sweet undertones from it um, definitely a good tobacco if it come from me and Matt we vape stuff like uh, Boba's Bounty and things like that a lot of good tobacco vapes but this one's right up there this one's a really good uh, it's not crazy it hit, the throw hits like a 12 on this, and it's a nice, decent flavor. A lot of tobacco flavors are like, I don't know, man. I tried a couple, and they're like vaping dust. Yeah. It tastes fucking horrible. <laughs> like dirty air. Yeah. But you guys this, know what I'm talking about. Yeah, vape mall. <laughs> um, but th this one's just nice. It's that, it's it's weird. kind of like, it's, 
I want to say like a normal tobacco, like a red Marlboro, with like like some some sugar poured on Isn't it. It's added sweet. It's sweet. It? Yeah, it's really del it's really delicious. But uh, enough about lasso. The next one that we're going to be trying is Summer Delight, and this one is a straw uh, strawberry watermelon. There's the bottle in color, a little nice uh, yellow tint to this. And this one, I I love right off the bat, man. If you want to give that a little sniff. Yeah, definitely. Um, about about summer delight. I mean, with the uh, with the juices they gave us, gave us descriptions right off the bat for them. Uh, they said that this one's a really subtle, light flavor. Um, summer delight is an in-your-face flavor. I mean, we got more to try. Maybe this is weak compared to their others, but this one's super good. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I'm getting I'm getting the strawberry and watermelon, kind of like a half and half smell. It's definitely a good one. Um, the thing that I could compare to, um, picture when you were a kid, you just got done trick or treating, and you're rifling through the candy. Uh, if you were like me, I mixed candies, which wasn't smart. I mixed chewy candies with hard candy, mm -hmm. uh, which pretty much just destroyed my teeth. But uh, this one kind of it's like the pink starburst. With like a watermelon Jolly Rancher, it's not too That's candy. Good, yeah. Yeah. It's not really too candy, but it's definitely candy enough. It's like it's a weird mix between artificial and a candy flavor. Yeah. It's really, I think this one might, like, you know, this this is really good. I would definitely purchase this one. I'm probably gonna purchase it. Uh, like I said, it's just a nice. They said it's supple, but like like I said before, I like flavors that like kick your taste buds and these this is ridiculous i looked at matt in the first paper but like, this is this is amazing yeah but i uh, mean it tastes just like it smells it smells delicious tastes really good kind of like a half and half mix between strawberry and watermelon yeah, too perfect not, balance yeah no dominating flavors yeah. um yeah super good definitely be be getting that one again uh that's really really good uh the next one here we have boogeyman's blood uh, which is a strawberry and cream horchata, horchata, horchata. Which horchata is like, a, it's a Mexican beverage. It's a cinnamon milk with, I believe, rice also. So it's kind of like a weird, weird vape and a weird flavor if, they, if you want to go that far. Got a little juice on my nose there. I mean, r right off the smell, it kind of smells a little wonky. A little wonky. Uh, the taste, it's really not for me. Um, cinnamon <coughs> is one of those things that I, they don't, it doesn't do it for me, the cinnamon. Um, for me, I mean, all I could say is it's a no-go. I'm sure if you like horchata, you'll, you'll probably really like this flavor. Uh, the strawberry and cream in it's amazing, but that, that cinnamony... I, I don't know how to describe it. It's just I don't I don't see cinnamon and strawberry as a good mix. Yeah. Um, awesome name though. It is it's really good. Awesome it name. really is good, and I kind of get it. You know, a little bit of Color a there. bite, but um, it's not it's not horrible. It's not you know it's an, I don't I I can vape this, but it's not definitely an all day vape. Uh, when I first tried it, I just, I didn't really care for it. Uh, just because sometimes with different vapes, it reminds me of things. This one kind of, I was telling Matt, it kind of reminded me like the taste. Like you could walk into like a, a crack store and you could, you know what I mean? That, that potpourri smell, but it's not bad. Like as I vape on it, it kind of, you kind of like get used to it but it's it's not a bad juice at all it's really actually really good i like it to me it doesn't <laughs> it doesn't taste like a craft store it just it's not for me but still not a bad juice all right guys cleaned out a couple of agos for you marie cottoned them uh for the next two flavors one of which will be chinchilla venom awesome name like i said i didn't know chinchillas had venom uh, this one is a light raspberry lemonade with vanilla notes. Uh, when we were doing a little smell test beforehand, uh, Matt uh, said that he really didn't get anything off the smell. Same here, really didn't get too much. Uh, but the proof is in the pudding on this one. The vape is, is really good.
The proof is in the pudding. In the pudding. Pudding. This There's a little bit of raspberry out of it. Uh, lemonade. Definitely. Uh, you definitely get a little bit of vanilla. They hit this description spot on. Uh, throw hit's really good. Um, like I said, I really don't get a little, I get a little bit of raspberry. I don't really get a lot. Probably just mainly because that lemonade. Uh, like I said before, I don't know. I think citrus flavor is just sometimes overpower. But this one's a nice, nice smooth vape. Uh, I was pretty stoked for this one. Um, but after vaping Summer's Delight, or Summer Delight, this, that's like my go-to flavor on this one. This one's not bad, but it's not my, my ultimate favorite. It's, it's kind of weird, but it's pretty good. It, it's not bad. It's, it's a refreshing vape like you would get with any lemonade flavor. Um, I could probably say this is the best. I know I always say this, the best, this, the best, that. Josh, you might agree with me. This is probably the best mixture of a lemonade with another fruit. Um, the lemonade's not so overpowering that you can't taste the fruit because I still get the raspberry. The vanilla, I'm sure that kind of just sweetens it up a little bit. Um, but I'm getting half raspberry, half lemonade. That's It's a perfect, you know, perfect lemonade mix for me. Yeah, definitely, definitely good. Uh, which leads us to our last and final juice from Hattrick. Bazinga sauce. Bazinga sauce. Which obviously, if anybody doesn't know Bazinga, uh, I believe that's from Game of Thrones. No, it's Big Bang Theory. I'm just <laughs> with you guys. Uh, this one is described so uh, simply palm berry smoothie. Uh, right off the bat, you know, you smell it. It smells just like a palm granite berry smoothie. Um, I definitely smell raspberry in there. There might be some other flavors as I sniff. It's really, really good. Uh, what, do you, what, what are your views on this one? Pomegranate like? berry smoothie. Perfect description. I'm getting everything that they're saying. Uh, the pomegranate, the berry, the smoothie part, it, it feels like I'm drinking a smoothie. Um, all around really, really good juice. Um, I would still have to say Summer Delight still has the most flavor. Uh, this is definitely, in my opinion, a more subtle flavor. Um, something maybe that you could do all day without getting sick of. Um, taking a couple drags, sometimes you get the pomegranate, sometimes you get the berry. All around, really, really, really good flavor. Yeah, like Matt said, it, it, you definitely get that that smoothie, you know, smooth uh, exhale on that. Uh, but their their descriptions are pretty much spot on with yeah. everything. Uh, definitely get. I definitely get raspberry. I don't know if there's you know other berries mixed into there. Um, I'm sure, but you definitely get the the pomegranate in there and smoothie. You know, there's fucking no like just smoothie flavor. So you know, it's it's bomb. It's really good. Yeah, it's very very it's good. Bazinga. <laughs> um, all around, really 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 good juice company. Yeah. Um, the prices really aren't too bad. Um, very very nice bottles um jamie and jonathan you know we would like to thank you guys again um you know this is a pretty new new juice company just trying to get their name out there uh you guys are doing all the right things definitely keep it up um josh what were you talking to me about earlier they have uh contests on their website oh uh especially i'm not doing it justice so please check their their website out, it's www.hattrickvapor.com. Hattrick Vapor, just being one word, no space. Um, they have a mystery e-juice contest. Essentially, I'm, I read up on it. I'm, I'm believing uh, pretty soon they're going to start sending a sample of it at zero nick so you don't get any nicotine uh, balance out, or nicotine, you know, kind of like playing it, off your taste. Yeah. It's easier to taste everything. Uh, but essentially what they're doing is, if you can describe what the, the flavors are, uh, first place you get the juice, you pick the juice name, you get recognized on their Facebook and Twitter. Really cool. Uh, you get a free 30 mil juice of your uh, choosing and a $10 credit on their website. And there, I believe there also is a second place winner, I'm not 100% sure. Um, that one might just be if you get close enough, you might just get like a 15 mil 
and maybe the same exact thing, like ten bucks. But uh, that's kind of cool. They kind of yeah, it's, it's really it's, nice. It's, you know, they're definitely coming uh, towards customer. Their customer service is really good. Uh, when I was reading, uh, definitely one thing I want to point out: take a look at their about us right on there. They got a little about us link right there. Uh, they pretty much just say, hey, you know, we came into the, with open arms and from the vaping community. Uh, essentially, they just want to produce the best vaping experience for everybody. And they're hitting the nail on the head with this. Uh, they have a wide variety of different flavors. As you can see, we kind of did, you know, a couple of they different categories. Of yeah, um, they have something that suits everybody. Yeah. And like I said, they do a custom creation. Uh, one of the things that I point I didn't point out, but that's one of their main thing is they go off customer feedback. A lot of their juices were uh, named and moved along with by customers feedback, which is really nice. I'm, I'm sure I'm almost positive. I think Boogeyman and Chinchilla were customer creations. I could be wrong there, but when uh, when we were picking out flavors, I thought I saw something about that. That that might be it, but. But yeah, like Matt said, like even if it's not, they I mean, they have a lot of flavors that are inspired by their by customers. Um, like I said, a very good juice company, very fairly priced. Uh, definitely sign up for their uh, email newsletter. They left they give you a heads up on up and coming discounts. Like I said, they just did one for the spring, which was forty percent off juice. Which is amazing and Already right off, low prices. Yeah, too. and right off the bat, you're you know if you like them on Facebook or follow them on Twitter, you're say you get to save ten percent off your order, which is very nice. And everything is made like from the U.S. and made in U.S. Uh, they do have a climate uh, treated and controlled uh, juice lab, so everything's made you know sterile and everything like that. You don't have no Not worries. Not in someone's basement. Yeah, or... you don't have anybody you know fucking trying to make juice in a parking lot or in the back of a Ford Pinto or some shit like that, but definitely uh, Jamie and Jonathan, thank you once again definitely. for sending us, I mean they sent us five 15 mils to try, and that that was pretty cool. Um, We're going to be vaping all these too, Yeah, especially yeah. Lasso that'll probably be gone by tomorrow I'm, so I'm smooth. I'm, I'm stealing Summer Delight Yeah, if you guys hattrickvapor.com, check these guys out, get yourself a bottle of Summer Delight uh, I I could probably guarantee if you like fruit vapes you're gonna like it. I can put a guarantee on that. Summer's coming up anyways. Why yeah. not treat yourself to a nice summer vape? Yeah. Uh, definitely. That they took the two top fruits that are known in summer of strawberry and watermelon, and combined them with a nice ba a, a nice balanced juice. Perfect. But uh, I definitely give these guys a nine nine out of ten. Definitely me too. Um, Alright, I fucking hate my camera. Cuts out every 10 minutes without me even knowing. Um, but basically, before that cut out, um, I was just telling you guys that uh, me and Josh here, we emailed the top 10 YouTubers um, that do e-juice and stuff like that. Um, e-juice reviews, mod reviews, whatever. Uh, we emailed 10 of them about 2-3 weeks ago about that two three weeks Long. ago um, basically what we emailed them and said was you know we're just starting out doing reviews this and that um, not even them to check out our channel or anything like that we just wanted to know you know what the people out there in YouTube land uh, want to know what you guys want to see um, juices devices stuff like that um, how we can make our channel better um, we're not trying to we're not trying to compete with them. We're just basically trying, you know, the more people on YouTube talking about e-cigarettes and e-juice and mods and devices, the better it's going to be for the vaping community. Uh, not one of them got back to us, which is pretty, you know, a pretty shitty thing. Um, I know they got thousands of subscribers, thousands of emails, this and that, but after three weeks... Um, me and Josh here are going to be taking this a little bit more serious. Um, as soon as you email us, we're going to get back to you that day. Um, email us, just say, hey, you know, I got a new device, you know, here it is, what do you guys think? You know, if, if you want to email us and just talk, we like talking to you guys. Um, but that's basically it. Um, just want to let you guys know, if you do email us, we're going to try our hardest to get back within that day. 
me and Josh both work full-time jobs, so it's not probably going to be that hour. Uh, but as soon as we get free time during our day, we're going to, you know, always stay on top of that. Oh, yeah, definitely. Um, but, yeah, that's basically it. Josh, any last words, man? Uh, just like Matt said, we just want to uh, do everything right. You know, we were in the same boat as a lot of you guys that are starting out. Uh, we sent, you know, shit to people, top reviewers, and they never, they never answered us back. Uh, it's kind of frustrating when you got a question and nobody wants to help you. The whole point of this is to help everybody. But um, that's pretty much it. Like, we just want to help you guys. Like Matt said, if you guys need anything or, you know, just, hey, hey, look, and I got, you know, a new a new mod, you know, definitely. Or, get, hey, you know, <clears throat> a fucking a bird shit on me walking out of my house today. Yeah, that just, doesn't matter. You know, try to make us laugh. I mean, we're here to talk to you guys, you know. Definitely. Uh, like I said, we just want to make this a... Like, you guys were sitting right next to us, you know, doing this. That's our whole point. We don't want it to seem like you guys are so distant. Because you guys are what make this channel. It's not me and Matt doing this. It's you guys. Your feedback, your participation. Uh, but that's all I, I, all I can say is just stick with us and we're going to be banging out shit quick as hell. Yeah, we're going to try. I mean, like I said, we both have full-time jobs. This is kind of like our second job. Um... But we love it. We love doing this shit. Uh, we're always going to give you guys honest reviews, honest, you know, we're honest people here. Um, you probably don't see that because you're probably 10,000 miles away from us, but we're honest people. Uh, like we said, check out Summer Delight by Hattrick Vapor. Um, tried Boogie, Boogie Man's Blood. It, it just wasn't for us. We're not going to lie to you guys. Um, but yeah, guys, thank you again for, uh, for watching, staying tuned. Uh, you know, sticking with us through all this, and uh, we'll see you guys next time, all right? Keep on vaping. Keep vaping.